Welcome, 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 welcome. Sorry, I just pulled my little tape recorder out from the beginning of the video. Um, welcome, welcome. Libra, Libra. Go on, love. First off, I'm a number. Okay. Um, kind of feel like you're making moves. You're making progress. You're going towards things. You're, you're, you're getting your, your mojo back. You're feeling a little more liberated. You're, you're feeling more like yourself. And if you're not, you're about to. Um, make sure if you're ready to launch something, you launch. Okay. You just, you go. It is time to stand for yourself. I know you haven't been feeling like you want to. Um, but you should. Okay. Um, you're going into your 10th house, which has to do with career, your destiny, things like this. Things are going to start being revealed to you guys. Okay. Um, but I think most of all, you know, what I'm feeling is you guys moving forward, you know, so that's great because I like the fact that I feel like you guys are, are moving forward. So let's see. I'm going to do the rose spread. Okay. And I'm going to do your, your core issue, how you're feeling, what, or like your attitude towards it, how you dealt with it in the past, then I'm going to do your advice, and then I'm going to go where it's heading, and then advice for the future, which is advice for November or the first two weeks, okay? Advice should be taken throughout the month, though. So. Universal advice. So let's see what's going on, my little librarians, my little Libras. Core issue. Core issue. eight of wands so with this being an issue okay because the eight of wands talks about communication internet text messaging phone calls it also talks about a journey it's a very spiritual card so i think the issue is you're not taking your journey okay you're you're feeling a little stagnant that's the issue or you're not sending a message that's an issue or you're not getting a message is an issue whatever this is whether it's lack of communication or moving forward Okay, but you are about to move forward. So, and that could be an issue for you too. Maybe some of you legitimately don't want to move forward. You know what I'm saying? So I need I need to pull some more cards to kind of see what we're working at. So past feelings, you know, is the two of pens. It's, it's you trying to balance out how you feel about this situation. So again, it's not giving me a definitive answer. But it is you. Some of you are just... Feel persistent on balancing things out, okay? Um, I think you're juggling a lot, but because you have to, you don't really have a choice. You're doing a good job, though. I don't see that being an issue. What about the path of action? the devil with the five of cups okay so this is you know you dealing with a disturbing outcome when it comes to something either it's at a party some type of devastation some type of devastating news um or there was a third party or how you were dealing with it was just kind of dwelling in the past and some of you were dealing with addictions that type of stuff um Whatever it is you were dealing with was, was sorrow, was harboring pain from the past, harboring memories, not going towards things the right way, okay? Going towards things with quite the attitude. Um, I think you were what you were really trying to do was keep yourself busy and focused, 
Um, but when you did communicate or when you were feeling certain ways, you know, it was very toxic. It was very, um, very manipulating, very, um, you were basically having a pity party, you know, so I really hope you're not in that energy anymore. It is the past energy, so that's great, okay, because it looks like you want to move forward. It looks like, but I think the issue is that some of you are still harboring onto this, the past. It is time to release, let go, okay? I know you guys have been going through a lot the next last couple months, but I really feel like you, you're getting out of this and you're just kind of like, you're like wet. Some of you, some people won't even leave this alone. Some of you are detoxing and moving forward. This is about pushing through. Okay. Advice. Advice. The world. End this shit. Wrap this shit up. Wrap up the self-pity. Wrap up the toxic the toxicity, the codependencies, the addictions, wrap it up. Let the past go. That is the best advice for you so you can get this journey started. Let's get this party started. All right, wrap it up. Let the feelings go. If you're harboring, let it go. If you don't forgive this person or situation, forgive yourself for not forgiving the situation. Okay. How you're presently feeling. So you're getting at him some, some rough energy, so good for you. I'm excited because I didn't realize, I mean, I knew some of you were going through some stuff, but I mean, that's some toxic, heavy stuff, so I'm really glad you're pushing through. So I think you're just waiting for this journey to start, to be honest with you. How my Libras are currently feeling, please. All right, the star on the page of ones. You're ready to take that damn adventure. You're, you're waiting for it. You're like, let's go. Giddy up, giddy up. Like, let's go. I am ready to make my dreams come through. true. I am ready to heal. I am ready to push through. I am ready to step into beast mode. Okay. So currently you're waiting on this new journey to start. I'm telling you, it's coming. Okay. So where this is heading. Apparently it's heading right towards your dreams. You're about to go on a brand new adventure. That's too many, but I saw the moon, so it's it's unknown to you. Okay, where is this heading? Again, one, two, three, four, five. Where is this heading? Some of you are not using your intuition right now. Where is this heading? It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Okay, where is this heading? But to me, right off the bat, it's already telling me. You know. Um. You're about to start a journey, so let it just come to you, all right? So I, I'm loving, here's the Ace of Pens, look at that. It's exactly where it's heading. Fabulous. I love that currently, you're just like, I am ready for this to start. Like, bring it on. Oh, they're bringing it. All right, I told you, you're moving forward. Opportunity is coming. So, advice for the next few weeks. <clears throat> the fool. Let let the past go. Stop holding on to toxic stuff and have this beautiful new start. All right, it's the fool. It's like the moon. Your blindfold's on. You're going towards the unknown. I want this top card, so I don't know why. Um, But, and you're looking at all this. Okay, you're ready. Yep, that's why. The six of pence. Gifts are coming. Stuff is about to be balanced out. The scales are about to be balanced, and that is beautiful because this is the minor arcana for you guys. Okay. It's a it's a little victory, but it's something to be proud of. So please go towards the unknown. Okay. So let's pull your moon card. Please let go of any toxicity that you are holding on to. Let go of any grudges, any attitude. Let it go. Go watch Frozen. Let it go, let it go. Communication is key. 
And here's the thing, I was gonna mention that with this being covered over the mouth, okay? But I'm not worried about it. But in order for you to obviously have a new stop, move forward, go on this journey, which is coming, it's here, all right? You're, you're being positive, you're healing, you're ready to take this adventure, okay? You're just waiting for it to fall into place. Um, you're going to have to communicate. You might not want to, but you have to. You have this, I, I told you, you guys were moving. Things are about to shift for you. A new star, Ace of Pentacles, the Fool, the Eight of Wands. Awesome sauce at the bottom of the deck. You have the eight of pens, and then you go straight to the ten of pens. Okay, I think only if you go towards the unknown. Stay determined. The queen of wands is right there, too. A successful relationship usually comes down to one thing communication, especially with a new moon. Start the new cycle communicating with this person or the question you're asking about, or whatever. Talking through this thing to get your answer, whatever it is you're asking about. If you can't talk to the person, you can journal it down. Emails, text messages, other forms of communications will also come in now. If the issue you're asking about concerns a sibling or a neighbor, there's a new start coming. A time to wipe the slight slate clean. This card also suggests you've been too frivolous lately and need to get grounded again. But most importantly, drawing this card emphasizes that you need to communicate for your new start. Write down a list of people that you write the most, okay? And, and see if you're prioritizing things the right way, okay? Time to talk to somebody and tell somebody how you feel. Don't be all up in your head, okay? Know your heart. Don't be all in your head and not heart okay so you're all up in your head and not your heart okay yeah because you're the past the toxicity okay um but it is a card of communication guys okay and you know you might be a little scattered right now but it's okay meditate if you can it's a new start coming which is great. Make sure you're prioritizing things the right way, though. Okay? It's a pretty important message. Some of you are dealing with a twin, though, because it's the Gemini twin right now. And communication is the house of Gemini. Um, you gotta let this toxicity go. Continue being positive. Okay? It's working for you. It really, truly is. Gifts are coming. You gotta release the past. You do gotta get that balance again. You, get, you do gotta even out the scales, all right? But it, it, it's coming. The balance is coming. Have this new stat. I'm gonna tell you right now, communication is really, really key. It's funny, I almost said something. I was like, hmm, it's a new stat regardless. But unless you guys communicate or let go, even if it's writing in a journey, a journal, or talking to the divine, or forgiving yourself for not forgiving, like I said, you know what I'm saying? Once that, that happens, and you accept the past, and you leave the past, and you start fresh, whether it's with the past or not, your new starts here. I don't know if that's anywhere, but your new starts here. You have the fool, the ace of pens, and the, the eight of wands. Communication's coming in, or it's either this or you need to communicate. The issue might be you not communicating with somebody, okay? So if you want that new start, open up the lines of communication, okay? Um, 